Hey Gary, it's Michael here at uh, Peter Balje. Thanks for giving me a call today. Um, wanted just to take a quick video for you of the Cadillac that's behind me here. Um, as you, as we spoke about on the phone, this is one of the alternatives to uh, to the Buick that we spoke about. Um, so I'll just go a quick walk around with you, so that you can uh, just take a look at what the car looks like. Um, it's a 2014 model year, and it just has uh, a touch over 26k on it. Um, it's a Cadillac ATS, and this one is uh, trimmed out with the two liter. Uh, motor and um, all of the uh, fancy stuff that you would expect from a Cadillac on the inside. Um, projector headlights in the front. Uh, this is the brand new redesigned car that just debuted last year. So um, really, really nice finish overall. They use a really nice uh, brushed aluminum wheel and um, there's lots of other brushed aluminum accents around uh, around the car. Car's finished beautifully. You can see the door handles there finished in a nice aluminum. Uh, beautiful LED tail lights on the car as well, and they've done a really nice job with the exhaust pipes too. Just gives it a bit of a bit of a sporty look down at the bottom there. Um, I'll take you on the inside really quick. So on the inside, aluminum trim, and it's real aluminum, real brushed aluminum, and then they also have a polished aluminum door handle here. Uh, so cars, you know, obviously finished just like you would expect a Cadillac to be. Um, all of the power options, power windows, power locks, power mirrors, you have memory seating as standard, um, as well as these power seats with uh, power lumbar uh, as well. Car has uh, automatic transmission and a touch screen on the dash there that controls all of your uh, climate control, radio, satellite radio features, um, and all that sort of stuff. I just wanna show you the remote start because this is actually pretty cool. So on the key fob that you get, it looks just like this. And uh, what you would do is you just push the lock button and then you would push and hold the circle button and the car fires right up remote for you. You can also turn it off with the key fob if you've already fired it up and change your mind. So right now I'll just touch this button right here, unlocks the car, and I open it up, jump on the inside, and I can actually just put the key in my pocket, put my foot on the brake, and then just touch the start button here, and then everything comes to life. So heated seats in this car as well, um, heated steering wheel here, cruise control there, and um, just your audio controls like volume, um, uh, a selector for favorite stations, as well as uh, the ability to tune up and down or change your track on a CD. The touch screen is unlike kind of any others that you have and uh, it's very difficult to show you this in the video but any of the buttons that you press here or up on the screen, whenever you touch something the screen actually just has a little vibration that comes back through it and the panel down here as well um, just to sort of acknowledge that you've actually touched the, uh, touched the screen so that's kind of cool. Uh, beautiful stitching up in through the dash, goes in through the doors as well. So just overall a really nice vehicle. So Gary, that's the, uh, that's the Cadillac there. And um, I'll include a little bit of pricing information in an email for you. And if you have any other questions or anything else I can help you out with, it's Michael Iorio at Peter Balje. And I hope you liked the video.